Hello views, don't drag and watch the finished video, hopefully something great awaits you ahead. The Young and the Restless, Y and R. Spoilers reveal that Diane Jenkins Abbott, Susan Walters, and Jack Abbott, Peter Bergman, may be married, but they never had a real chance to celebrate their union. Jack and Diane had a tiny ceremony with the Justice of the Peace, but they're hoping to have a big wedding reception down the road. New fall preview spoilers indicate that Diane and Jack will indeed throw a wedding reception this autumn, so they'll plan to make it a party to remember. Jack and Diane may not have very many supporters when it comes to their marriage, but they'll still send out some invitations and hope to have a good time. This will be Diane and Jack's opportunity to prove they're a power couple and show off just how deeply in love they really are. Of course, parties don't usually go according to plan in Geno City, so don't expect this one to go off without a hitch either. This wedding reception will set the stage for some epic drama, so let's talk about what's coming up. Vi and R spoilers say Ashley Abbott, Eileen Davidson, will make a huge announcement ahead of this bash, so it's possible that'll tie in with the shockers that are about to unfold. However, there will be other key players and chances to shake things up. Billy Abbott, Jason Thompson, will show off his sinister side in the coming weeks, so he just might make a bold move against Diane and Jack at this event. Then again, we know Billy's feud with Tucker McCall, Traver Street John, will become a major issue as we build to this post-wedding celebration. Billy's showdown with Tucker could upstage Diane and Jack's extravagant chandig, so that's a possibility to prepare for. There'll even be some sizzling encounters once this event gets underway, which gives fans another reason to look forward to all the fun. Bottom line, Jack and Diane's wedding reception will make quite a splash this fall, so we'll offer updates as other news emerges about the party and any blow-ups it'll bring. Jack will think Ashley would have done the same for Diane since that's the kind of person she is at her core. Almost losing Ashley really shook Jack up, so he'll hope they can use this to find common ground. Ashley will agree to give Diane the benefit of the doubt, but she'll make it clear that she'll go after her heart if there's even one misstep. Jack will feel confident that won't happen and will agree to be more tolerant of Tucker McCall, Traver Street John as well. Although Jack will wonder if Ashley still plans to leave Jab out and start a new company, he'll get that Ashley needs time to think and talk to Tucker. Jack will just be happy they're siblings instead of enemies, so they'll share a warm embrace. Afterward, Ashley will flash back to John Abbott, Jerry Douglas, telling her to drop all the animosity with Jack, so she'll text Tucker to suggest an ASAP trip to Paris for their honeymoon. Ashley will look pensive as she mutters about having some things to figure out. At the Jazz Lounge, Billy Abbott, Jason Thompson, will sit at the bar with Adam Newman, Mark Grossman, and acknowledge that he understands him a bit better due to his own family situation right now. Adam will be surprised by Billy's empathy, but he won't think they're treated the same since he's viewed as a cold, manipulative narcissist while Billy's just a screw-up. Plus, Adam will think Jack is fair and will keep Billy around as long as he does right by Jabot. That'll leave Adam wondering if Jack is really waiting for Billy to screw up or if Billy is actually screwing up. Summer will also mention that Heather Stevens, Vale Bloom, has agreed to help her with the divorce proceedings, so there will be some awkward tension before she heads back to work while Kyle does the same. Nikki will assure Audra that they'll get to that, but first she'll want to know what the hell Audra is doing with Kyle. Although Nikki will point out that Kyle is married to her granddaughter, Audra will insist they're getting a divorce and that Kyle can make his own choices. Nikki will act like Audra has a pattern of causing problems for people she cares about since she also broke Noah Newman's, Rory Gibson, heart. Nevertheless, Nikki will be impressed with Audra's work and will acknowledge that Victor Newman, Eric Braden, thinks highly of her. That's why Nikki will be willing to give Audra a chance to work as her COO, but there will be a catch. Nikki will want Audra to give Kyle and Summer an opportunity to reconcile, which means Audra needs to forget about Kyle and leave him alone, or her future at Newman Media is over. The young and the restless spoilers say Nikki's ultimatum will lead to trouble, so stay tuned. CDL's where you want to be for exciting young and the restless spoilers, updates and news, so make us your favorite Yi and our hotspot.